All right, guys, you said the deeper we go, the more intense we get. The older Harry gets, the darker the storyline gets. We're on number four now. Four. Harry's getting older, but what's up, guys? If you are new here, you're at the Rob Squad's home theater with your girl, Amber. And your boy, Jay. And as he gets older, he's getting a little more feisty, For too. Sure. He's getting He's getting a lot braver. Like in the last one, oh, goodness, we could talk so much about it, how they went back in time, thought he'd seen his dad, but it was really him. We could go on and on and Absolutely on and on. Absolutely crazy. So we're ready for number four, Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. You know, with these stories, I feel like every time, Harry's going to beat somebody. I, I don't know who it is, but Harry's going to beat him. They're always a good storyline, so I expect the same with this one as well. Guys, for sure, we are so in love with this franchise. The characters are awesome. Storyline's great. I can't wait to see what we're going to get into today with Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. Guys, go ahead and help us out by liking the video, subscribing to the RSR family, and turning on that post notification bell so you don't miss a movie Monday or a film Friday. As we tell you guys, grab your favorite drink, your favorite snack. Your blanket. Let's check out, ooh, Spider-Man blanket too. <laughs> Let's check out Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. Let's go. Play me the, the Harry Potter. I know, I'm ready for that sound. Play me that sound. Kind of got a little bit of it. Little. They just made it a little darker. They did make it darker, that's what it is. Oh, see the caretaker? I know, I'm sure if I'm a caretaker and see someone up there with the light turning on, I ain't going That's by myself. Odd. He said dang kids, though, so maybe it's like a thing. Mm -mm. You never know. You can wait till the morning. Bingo. Sunday. Wait till it's sunny outside. <laughs> Where is Malfoy? Oh, no. No, no, I bought Voldemort. I only bought. Perhaps if we were to do it without the boy. No! The rat. I will not disappoint you, my lord. Gold. Who is that? Comrades, send them aside. He's probably so confused. <laughs> oh, parcel dog. The snake's telling him. Buckle caretaker is standing just outside the door. <sighs> In Wormtail, so I can give our guest a proper greeting. Uh, Wormtail. <laughs> See, that's why I don't go up checking on stuff. <laughs> you all right? Hermione, bad dream. When did you get here? Just now, you. Last night. So Voldemort is back. Wake up, Ronald. Bloody hell. Oh, <laughs> get rest. Your mother says breakfast's ready. Look how much older Ron looks. I know. But they should have went, went back and found and killed that mm -hmm. rat. This strapping young lad must be Cedric, am I right? Yes, sir. Just... Do you know who that is? No. Uh, from Twilight? You've never seen Twilight? No. <laughs> great, great pleasure. I remember Twilight was big and we were like, yeah. into middle school maybe? Well, that's Edward. Just over there! You really think I was going to sit down and watch some Twilight? <laughs> no, I totally <laughs> never would think you would watch Twilight. Time to go! What's a pork cake? Ready? After three! They're all holding on to a boot. <laughs> That is cool. Let go! <laughs> this is probably so riveting. <laughs> that is awesome. Look at them. <laughs> well, kids, welcome to the Quidditch World Cup. Yes, oh, Quidditch. That's cool. We didn't get much Quidditch in the last we one. Didn't. It's like uh, the soccer World Cup, but Quidditch. <laughs> Oh, look how oh, big it is I was inside. About to say, they all gonna fit in that little yeah. tube. Ron, get out of the kitchen. We're all hungry. Yeah, get out of the kitchen, Ron. Beat. That is sick. Wow. You want to talk about crowd on top of you? How far up are we? We'll put it this way: if it rains, ah, oh. be the first to know. <laughs> Cornelius Fudge himself. Don't boast. He looks like you're no swine in Cornelius Fudge. Do enjoy yourself, won't you, while you can. 
Oh, I can't stain that I slime know. ball. And the deal is, Draco is the first one to run off crying like a little sissy. Mm-hmm. But what a talk a big mad mm-hmm. game. My daddy says. My daddy drives a Rolls <laughs> Royce. Well, my father drives a Bentley. <laughs> it's the Irish. Let's try. And then it- yes, let's go Irish. So cool. <laughs> Let's go. My family has deep roots in Ireland. <laughs> Bulgarians. Bulgarians. Whoa. <laughs> That's such a cool stadium. To the final of the 422nd. Quidditch World Cup. Do you see how he's using his wand to make it like, go over the microphone? Oh, that is what he's doing. There's no one like Trump. I love the Weasleys. Likes the wind. Oh, well, he's more than an athlete. Oh, <laughs> he's an artist. Thank you. Why is this you after a Bengals game? Joe Burrow. He's amazing. <laughs> it's not the Irish. What? You've got to get out of here. Now! It sounded fi- like fireworks. Okay, everybody, and stick together! Frank George! Oh, no! Death Eaters? Death Eaters? Hurry! Wow. This is chaotic and traumatizing. <laughs> Oh, you get kicked in the face. Oh, bones left, everything burnt up. What? What's the purpose? Oh, this guy. Oh no, and Harry's there. Nowhere to hide. Oh my. We didn't get any breathing room in this one. Let's just like bam, straight, straight into yeah. it. They're his two, aren't they? His followers. Death Eaters. Follow me. What a name, Death Eaters. Mm. Voldemort ain't playing this time. He said, I done been defeated twice now. <laughs> I'm coming back heavy hitting. Those words been defeated multiple times by Harry now. A licorice wand. Oh. I love candy. On second thought, just the dribbles. From like Hogwarts from this world. Thanks. Remember, it's always magical. It's it is magical, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Anything sweet for you? Is that Harry? Oh, Harry got that look in his eye. I know. You know Sirius will want to hear about this. What you saw at the World Cup and the dream. Please tell me Sirius is going to be in this one. Those who've read the book gave us like a lot of context, more context on Sirius Black in the in the comments yeah. in the last video. Oh, Pegasus. how beautiful, Pegasus! That's what you call flying horse, right? I just know the one from uh, Hercules. Now we're all settled in and sorted. Oh, I hear Dumbledore. Hogwarts has been chosen to host. Where's this cat? Of the Bow Batten's Academy of Magic and their headmistress. So Hogwarts isn't the only magic school. Oh. Fancy. Did you hear the sigh? Bloody hell. They have. <laughs> Golly, you see how tall she is? That's one big woman. <laughs> That's one big woman. Golly. 
They have like dust. Are these like fairies? I don't know. Oh, oh. wow. These are like the Marines. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Professor Dumbledore, my horses have traveled a long way. She said Dumbledore. Monsieur Agri, mm -hmm. they drink only single malt whiskey. <laughs> they drink whiskey? <laughs> single malt whiskey. <laughs> you idiot! <laughs> Come on, you. That's being a bad dinner guest. <laughs> Putting a fork or something on his hand. International Magical Cooperation, Mr. Bartimus Crouch. Whoa. Yeah, wow. Madame Moody. That was cool. Dark wizard catcher. Yeah. My dear old friend, thanks for coming. Stupid ceiling. Stupid ceiling. I don't know, but I don't think it's pumpkin juice. <laughs> pumpkin juice don't make you shake like that after it. Some puts a fire in your chest. There's no turning back, as from this moment, Triwizard Tournament has begun. That's cool how you get your name in the cup. You know Harry got to get in it. Yeah, of course. You know, it. you know, it's worth mentioning that this is the one they had to recast Dumbledore for. They had to what? Recast Dumbledore for. I mean, they did a fantastic job, but this is a new one. A new Dumbledore? Mm -hmm. He passed. What? I didn't even realize like, it. Yeah, they did a fantastic job recasting. I, no way. How did I not even realize that? I read it in the comments that this was... But don't be surprised we see a new one. Ministry malcontent and your new defense against the dark arts teacher. I am here because Dumbledore. There's always a new teacher. Always. At the end. Any questions? He's gonna be interesting. Earn you a one-way ticket to Azkaban. Correct. Ooh. You need to find another place to put your chewing gum besides the underside of your desk, Mr. Finnegan. Ooh. Which curse shall we see first? Weasley. Yes. Stand. Oh no. <laughs> Chose oh, the wrong one. Lovely little beauty. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, wow. She's lethal. <laughs> oh, no. That's giving me chills. Sorry. Yes. Yeah, bite him. <laughs> bite him. It's like a spider crab. Yeah. Up, up, come on. Long bottom, is it? Up. Long bottom. Professor Sprout tells me you have an aptitude for herbology. Herbology. The Cruciatus, yes. Correct, correct. Come, come. What, what house was Longbottom in? The Torture Curse. Oh, I see. He was in the same one as Harry then. Stop it! Can't you see it's bothering him? Stop it! What was that? Yeah, what was that one? Killing curse. Only one person is known to have survived it. He's sitting in this room. Of course. He gets around Harry. He starts drinking that like mm. holy water. <laughs> <laughs> what a winding staircase. We'll have a cup of tea. I want to show you something. Yeah, Neville was really bothered. See, I don't know that actor too well because I've only seen like the first or maybe the second of Twilight of the Twilight series. Ready, Fred? Ready, George? Bottoms up. These boys. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. They're always up to something, uh -huh. those two. They're the ones who gave Member Harry that map. Mm hmm. Yeah. It worked? <laughs> Toss them out. To thank you. Look at them now. <gasps> said you said. <gasps> I'll write you on a piece of my Get that. Oh. <laughs> That's the thing. Siblings fight until till the end. So the crumb guy's a student. I didn't. I didn't think that he was. And he was. For, you remember, he played for that mm -hmm. the national team. Mm -hmm. Was it Bulgaria? Bulgaria. 
is. I don't even really look at him like that. It is a different guy. The dumb set champion is Victor Krupp. Yeah. 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 Fleur Delacour. Fleur Delacour. Yeah. But in the end, only one will go down in history. Why is it only not Only one hairs? will hoist this chalice of champions. He's 17 or older. He's not at Is he not 17? Yet. Victory for Triwizard Cup. Oh, that's fancy. <laughs> I sip my whiskey out of that. <laughs> what was it doing? Is that another name? It's gonna be Harry. Watch. There's no way. Harry Potter. What? He didn't put his name in there. He he couldn't get in. No. No. Harry Potter. Are you fucking just? I'd be a little shaky with Dumbledore talking to me like that because he's normally like. He's very calm, yeah. He's a cheat! You're not even 17 yet! Yeah, how'd this happen? He didn't cheat, the, the mm -hmm. deal chose him. Like it's Harry, like I'd want to chill too. Like mm -hmm. I feel like he's always just being the chosen one. Yeah, can I just one, like know? sit back? Right. Okay, let me slide this once. One semester. The goblet of fire constitutes a binding magical contract. Mr. Potter has no choice. Wow. He is, as of tonight, a tri wizard champion. He ain't got no choice. That chose him. Harry's like, oh man. Man, poor Harry. you always getting thrown into mm -hmm. stuff. He ain't even trying to do. You heard Barty. The rules are clear. Oh, the devil with Barty. <laughs> the devil mm -hmm. with him. If we are to truly discover the meaning of these events, perhaps we should, for the time being, let them unfold. Do nothing. Offer him up as bait. Put him as a boy. Yeah. What are they about to be going into? You must be anxious enough as it is, knowing what lies ahead. And again, we all are. Did you see him pull that out of his head? That was cool. Ron Weasley, Harry Potter, stupid friend. Oh, come on, Ron. Piss off. <laughs> Ron! Yo. Ron's hormones are like... <laughs> a little crazy in this one. He's jealous. Mm-hmm. Hello. <laughs> I'm Rita Skeeter. Rita Skeeter. Me, myself, and I want to know. Not to mention my rabid readers. Uh, rabid so. readers. It's a broom cupboard. You should feel right at home then. Don't mind if I use it. You should feel right at home. To have mastered spells that you wouldn't attempt in your dizziest daydreams. That's true. They probably know more spells than him. Yeah, for sure. I, I, I don't know. I haven't really. Barley is powerful. Keen to enter such a dangerous tournament. Uh, no, I, I didn't enter. <gasps> of course you didn't. Everyone loves to see your wink. He's like, no, seriously, I did. Yeah. That your attitude shows at best a pathological need for attention. Worst Dang. psychotic death wish. My eyes aren't glistening with the ghost of my past. <laughs> Dirty. She gonna twist the story mm -hmm. all up. She already was. A note from Sirius. Meet me in the Gryffindor common room. One o'clock this Saturday night, and make sure you're alone. Serious. Serious can't sneak. Mm. Well, he can sneak past people. He snuck mm -hmm. past them death thingies or them ghost dealies that was after him. His eyes swimming with the ghosts of his past. I choke him back tears. Mm -hmm. Choking back tears. Is that just his? It did. I kind of like kissing in Harry Potter movies. <sighs> Serious. That's cool. He wanted me. I don't know why, but he was going to use this man to get to me. So Harry had that dream that we seen at the mm -hmm. very beginning. The Death Eaters of the World Cup, your name rising from that goblet. These are not just coincidences. No, it's not coincidence. Mm -mm. Put your name in that goblet, Harry, but whoever did is no friend to you. People die in this tournament. I'm not ready for this, Sirius. You don't have a choice. He 
You said he doesn't know who put your name in the fire, but he thinks somebody did it. Maybe you're imagining things. Wouldn't be the first time. Probably just practicing for your next interview, I expect. Oh my goodness. I'm getting tired of Ron and his I'm little jealousy too. I'm saying like, Ron. Like, maybe he needs the stickers. <laughs> Not you when you're hungry. <laughs> this is teenage tragedy. Okay, so after that meeting, I would start to feel like, okay, I'm not really picked Amazing. because for some magical reason. I'm picked because somebody's after me. Yeah, and he said Igor used to be a Death Eater. Mm -hmm. uh, um, Run. Please don't ask me to say it again. Hagrid's looking for you. Well, you can tell Ronald. I'm not an owl. Right. Stop being petty. Mm-hmm. Especially after all they done been through. I know, for Ron to be acting like this over... Hagrid, where are we going? What's going on right now is a little crazy. Hagrid! Oh. What type of animal he about to pull up on now? You know Hagrid's got them, <laughs> got them weird animals stored. He's about to put the cloak on, too. He doesn't want him to be seen. Bonsoir, a lamp. Oh, it's the lady. Don't forget you, a lamp. What is it you wanted to show me? Okay, they're kind of the perfect couple, aren't they? What? Can we get closer? What are they doing? Oh. I have to admit that horn tail is a right nasty piece of work. <laughs> Didn't Ron tell you that? No, Ron been acting real funny lately. Wow. Watch the, <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, they don't know who they're messing with. I'm Harry saying. is that guy. Like, don't y'all have self respect? I bought him not to wear them. Don't worry about it. It's not like I tried to blow things up exactly. Man, Ron giving me weird vibes. Right. Like, like, like he may have put Harry's name in there. Father and I have a bet, you see. I don't think you're going to last ten minutes in this tournament. <sighs> you couldn't last one. Five. I don't give a <laughs> damn what your father thinks. Right. Pathetic. Nah, oh, no, you don't, know, Sonny. <laughs> Mm, made him do a That's what he is. Stinking, cowardly, scummy, butt what, what are you doing? He deserves it though. Look at it, just like yo yo. And... But if, is that a student? It's a student. Me, it's a ferret. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> Look at him, look at him. Oh, my father will hear about this. Professor Moody. Professor Moody. He's you threatening the wrong one. Alistair. It doesn't end here. Alistair. Alistair, just not play. I'd have mentioned it. You will do well to remember it. This is that coach that's been coaching since yep. like the 80s and 90s. They got away with a little more. And he's like, dang, can't turn kids into ferrets anymore. I like him. Yeah, he's kind of funny. <laughs> Bother telling you what's in there. Yeah, tell me. Believe it. Miss Delacour, she's as much a fairy princess as I am. As he is. Come on, Potter. What are your strengths? I don't know. Bravery, courage. Well, I can fly. I mean, I'm a fair flyer, but I. Bravery, for sure. But I'm not allowed a broom. You're allowed a wand. What does that mean? It seems like all like the dark arts teachers help Harry. <laughs> The last one did too, and no, he turned mm -hmm. out to be a coward at the end. Ted you off a blur, there you go. Thank you very much. They are really taking bets. Mm -hmm. How are you feeling? Okay? The key is to concentrate. She's looking out, as always. <laughs> oh, I'm like... Young love. Oh my oh. goodness, this woman here. She's gonna twist another story. Her and that quill. This stunt is for champions and friends. Tell her, Chrome. Gather round, please. Now, you've waited. You've wondered. God, homegirl is like eight foot tall. I know. Miss Delacour, if you will. The Welsh wow. green. The Chinese fireball. Harry gonna pick that horned one. What? The Swedish short snout. Sleeves. 
The Hungarian horn. Oh. The one that Hagrid said that one's a firecracker. Collect the egg. This you must do, for each egg contains a clue without which you cannot hope to proceed to the next task. It's cool how they drew them out of the bag. Perfect timing. We'll proceed to the next task, and now our fourth and final. Oh man, you you know the feeling of walking into like a big game or big race. Mm -hmm. Imagine walking into fighting a dragon to the death. Yeah. <laughs> Is it a little harmless egg? Oh. oh my gosh. I'd be so mad if I put my name in this cup at this point. I'd be like, no, who did this? <laughs> who did this? Oh. Why does he get the, the meanest dragon? I'm saying. He didn't even want to be here. You want Harry! You want! Akio Firebolt! What's going on? Do something! <laughs> Harry? Oh. He's got his broom. Oh no. No, I'm not going aerial with a dragon. Yeah! Well done, dragon! <laughs> that thing is on his butt. Look where you're going, Harry. Take off, Harry. He got his hand on the broom. How's he gonna beat it? Oh, no. They both fell. <laughs> Mama go there. Mama, there goes that man. Wow. He did it. Uh, he did it. Yes, Harry. You wouldn't die, Harry. No, you wouldn't die. All right, everyone, go back to your knitting. Good. This is gonna be uncomfortable enough that all you know is sods this thing in. <laughs> this is gonna be. <laughs> he said it's already gonna be uncomfortable. I reckon you have to be barking mad to put your own name in the goblet of fire. Come on, have you? <laughs> Took you long enough. Right. I wasn't the only one who thought you'd done it. Everyone was saying it behind your back. I told Hermione to tell you that Seamus told me that Bavardi told Ding that Hagrid was looking for you. Seamus never actually told me anything, so it was, it was really me all along. <laughs> oh, okay. After you figured that out. Who, who could possibly figure that out? <laughs> who could have figured that out, Ryan? That's completely mental. <laughs> <laughs> I suppose I was a bit distraught. Always. I feel you hear money. Do I? Nothing. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, Harry. Oh, so he, he got the ladies wanting him now. Oh! Look at this! I can't believe it. She's done it again. Miss Granger, a plain but ambitious. A plain. No word yet on how Harry Potter's taking this latest emotional blow. Wow, oh talk about media. Gosh. Not even safe in the wizarding world. Oh, look, Mum sent me something. I'm not knowing them yelling cards mm -hmm. over there. Oh, that was hilarious. Has been a tradition of the Triwizard Tournament. There's his cat. <laughs> since its inception. Well-mannered frivolity. Well-mannered. Frivolity. 
a dance. Oh. Oh. Silence. Oh. Watching that name by behaving like a babbling, bumbling band of baboons. <laughs> baboons. I love the way she talks. Mm -hmm. Oddly lion prepared to prance, Mr. Weasley. Will you join me, please? Oh. Oh. They always be choosing Ron. Two, three, one, two, three. Oh. <laughs> Come together. Boys, on your feet. The girl's like, okay. The boy's like, nah. <laughs> Never. Okay, long bottom. <gasps> In his dancing shoes, too. I'm thinking spit shines. And how are you supposed to get one on their own to ask them? Girls, why do they travel in packs? <laughs> Dragons. If you can't get a date, you can. <laughs> be at that level that was disgusting this rate will be the only ones on you without dates oh. dang <laughs> mushed his face my interest seems to know that neville's already got someone no i'm really depressed <laughs> long bottom got someone and you don't yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness big brothers where am i you're a girl they're well spotted can we run away it's just smacking them Snape be smacking the heck out of them. I won't be going alone because, believe it or not, someone's asked me. Someone's asked her. And I said yes. God. Who do you think asked her? Just gotta grit our teeth and do it. Tonight, when we get back to the. Oh, he about room. to smack the mess out of him. <laughs> I hope he did. Agreed. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> so beautiful in the winter. Wonder where is this a real place or is this like CGI? Somewhere in New Zealand again. Where it's really beautiful. <laughs> New Zealand is just beautiful. I don't know if maybe you want to go to the ball with me. Sorry, I didn't catch that. Oh, he's gonna ask him. Harry, I'm, I'm sorry, but maybe someone's you... already asked me. Oh? Well, I've I've said I'll go. Fine, no problem. It's tough. Poor Harry. Mm -hmm. It's alright. It's okay, Ron. It's alright. What's wrong with Ron? What happened to you? He just asked Fleur de Lacour out. Ooh. <sighs> she said yes. There she was walking by. You know, I like it when they walk. <laughs> <sighs> just sort of slipped out. Actually, he sort of screamed at her. It was a bit frightening. <laughs> What did you do then? What else? I ran for it. <laughs> I'm not cut out for this, Harry. Don't put a walk into me. Hi, Harry. Always like looking at them from behind. Did you hear? Bloody hell. Oh, the deal is mom made. Oh. Oh, you can't oh. wear that. You can't. Or the Weasleys always have like a lot of hand-me-downs mm. and things like that. No, those! My dress rose. Well, they're all right. No lace, no dodgy little collar. Oh. Well, I expect yours are more traditional. Traditional? They're ancient. <laughs> I do feel bad for him. Smell like my great aunt Jessie. Nobody wants to smell like their great aunt. You can't wear that, Ron. Murder me, Harry. For once, he's not being dramatic. <laughs> Why do you think she wouldn't tell us who she's coming with? Because we'd take the mickey out of her if she did. Long bottom. But he asked her. I'm a crack up if it's him. If it's him. Hello, boys. Don't you look dashing? Oh. Should we have told you that? No. Oh, you, well, now you know. Oh, oh no. So no, me, no. You, may, you may proceed into the great hall with Miss Patil. <laughs> See how she's looking at him. <laughs> Come along, this way. <laughs> she's taking one for the team. Look. She is here. taking one for the team. Come on, sis. Oh, she's going with the. Uh, I forgot his name. Oh, look at Hermione. She looks beautiful. Yeah, she does. Oh, so stunning. Of course. Really. Of course. But the woman in the paper called it out, kind of, mm -hmm. before she even really knew. Well, he's been, like, shooting her looks the whole time. No. 
I, I certainly don't. <laughs> Ron. Ron going back to his He's hating. just having the worst night. He hating again. Well, if you think about it, as the three friends, Ron gets the least amount of glory, always. Harry, take my waist. What? Now. See, I would need to be prepared for yes. this. I'd be sweating the whole time. I'd be stepping on your feet. Oh, yeah, I'd be sweating, nervous. <laughs> Catherine Ives. Demon cat. <laughs> Back to that flash. I wonder what his drink of choice is. Just <laughs> It's like a whiskey man. Something that warm you up a little bit. Moonshine. <laughs> Why are they so cute? Are you ready? <laughs> okay, they get a little loose. Rock and roll. Spin around like a crazy. <laughs> a dancing by himself. Dancing by himself. I put your hands up in the air. Like an ogre just don't. Like an ogre. Oh, they're just sitting there. Watching them dance. You the books, the hand goes to the library. We look like haters. Arm, leg, I'm yours. You're fraternizing with the enemy. The enemy? Who was it wanting his autograph? Now he's the enemy. Mm. She wanted to say something so bad. Ask me to dance or not. No. <clears throat> no. Ugh. Moody, moody, Ron. That's the theme for Ron. This movie is moody. He has been moody. This yes. Movie. He's way too old. What? What? That's what you think? Where have you been? Never mind. Off to bed, both of you. She wanted Ron to ask her. I know. I feel so sorry for her. I spoiled everything. Ron is such a. Th I'm sorry, he's a turd. He's being such a turd to her. She had a moment of vulnerability with you, Ron, and you missed it. She pretty much said she wanted Ron to ask. I know. Her. She said, "Next time, ask me first. That's a. That's an odd pairing. I see Haggard saying. <laughs> the bird's getting to her. Birds are just gross to me. I, for y'all, I hate birds. I got like a phobia of birds. <laughs> Except the cute, colorful parrots. I like those. <laughs> Other than that, yeah. Hey, this is the beginning of the movie. Mm hmm. He's having we're another back. dream. Yep, we're back. Let me see it again. Ah, yes. The time is close now. To tattoo. I can give our guest a proper greeting. Wide. You're all right, Harry. I just got in. <laughs> me. <laughs> oh, Neville. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Mostly he watches me study. It's a bit annoying, actually. <laughs> you are trying to figure this egg out, aren't you? What's that supposed to mean? Just means these tasks are designed to test you in the most brutal way. They're almost cruel. Yeah, the dragon is pretty cruel. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. It's not a bad place for a bar. Just take your egg and mull things over in the hot water. Did he give him a hint? Yeah, see, this guy don't seem bad. They kind of trade hints back and forth, though. They seem to be, like, looking out for each other, even though they're in like, competition. Wow, talk about a bath. I'm talking about a bath now. Oh, siren. That screaming from the egg. Is that what you think? Maybe. Maybe I was wrong. I'm definitely out of my mind. <laughs> what was that? I tried putting it in the water. Myrtle. 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 Long time. No see. I, I didn't mind not seeing you, Myrtle, and hearing her voice. 
Well, go on. Open it. All right, bro. You gotta back up off me for yeah, a Yeah, I know. I don't close. want Myrtle getting too close to me. Come see cause where our voices are. Can't sing above the ground. <laughs> that was cool. That was cool. That was cool. <laughs> Stop. Almost all the bubbles were gone. <laughs> Myrtle's a mess. <laughs> she is a mess. Why don't you help Potter put his books back? <laughs> the library at Hogwarts is so cool. And I'm sure extensive. Water for an hour, then great. But otherwise. I don't know about a turnip, but you can always use gillyweed. Gillyweed. That's cool that it. That Neville's kind of kind of possibly yeah. helping because remember the last uh, well do you remember the one where the mandrake was yeah, used? Yeah, oh, those were so cool. cool. Right there. Yeah, yeah, that's why I got this shirt because of the mandrake. Well, that makes you a right side better than Ron and Hermione. But where are they anyway? Did you see a little tent? He is just winging it. Simple enough. Put that in your mouth. Except for this, they will have but one hour to do so. And one... uh -huh. At the sound of the cannon. <laughs> Oh, he just grew gills. Was it called Gillyweed? Was that what it was? That's called? what it was. That's awesome. I don't know. I can't see him. Oh my god! I've killed Harry Potter. <laughs> oh. Yeah! That is so cool. <laughs> That's really cool. Look at his feet. This is nuts. Like all the effects and everything that they've done for each one of these movies. But this is wild. What does she have on her face? It's like an air like bubble. An air bubble, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Something just snatched her uh -huh. up, though. That's what it sounded like. <gasps> Is it a real mermaid? I love sirens. I love mermaids. Our daughter's room is actually done in mermaid. I just really like saying stuff like this because it's like, what if it's true, you know? Mermaids are real. We haven't explored nearly enough of the ocean to say mermaids aren't real. Facts. Whoa. <gasps> so they took Ron. Hermione? What the heck? Because he said um, at the beginning of this. Where like, are they at? Yeah, well, something has been stolen from each house. Oh, sheesh. That's oh, the, the that's that one dude. Oh, look at it's Yeah, you gotta save her. Wow. <laughs> it's so cool. That's <laughs> so cool. That was crazy. <laughs> Maui, Moana vibes. Of course, Harry would say. Yeah, he better get uh, bonus points for getting two of them. Oh no, it's weird. <laughs> Little what octopus squid those? gremlins. <laughs> I don't like them. No, I don't like them. Those things are vicious. What? No. 
so many of them. You see the marks he has on him from them? Come on, Harry. Ascentio. There we go. He made it. Barely again squeaked by. Even though she wasn't here to save my little sister. Oh. Thank you. Oh. Whoa, 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 it was her baby sister. Well, yes, a baby. I'm what wrong. Gabriel, my belle. Oh, Ron. Mercy. Come on! Come on! Attention! Attention! That is so cool how it turns into a mic. Not only Mr. Weasley, but the others as well. We've agreed to award him second place. Fair. Hmm. It ain't first, but it'll do. I can't stand that punk. I know. <laughs> Well done, boy. Gee, Hagrid, Harry. I'm sorry we haven't spoken. I He's definitely been watching. He's been keeping a close eye. Last boy who went into the Department of Mysteries never came out. What's wrong? What was that about? And they say I'm mad. Did he like slither his tongue or something? Yeah. Like a snake? It was, it was just weird. It was a moment for sure. The youngest. Try with her champion this ever been! Three! <laughs> <laughs> I love Haggard's spirit. <sighs> Something's close. Where was that guy's top hat? Mr. Crouch? What did you say to Excuse me? Excuse me, gentlemen. It may interest you to know this conversation is no longer private. <laughs> he batted him out. I want to know how dude got killed. No! Remind me of like little leeches. Sir. <clears throat> He's not really there. Should your testimony prove consequential, counsel may be prepared to order your immediate release. Look at the cage he's in. Oh, wait, wait, please, please, I have more. What about Snape? Severus Snape. Well, the counsel is very much aware I've given evidence on uh -huh. this matter. And prior to Lord Voldemort's downfall, turned spy for us at great personal <laughs> risk. Okay, some more info on Snape. Oh, Snape remains faithful to the Dark Lord. Silence! Snape was a Death Eater? He said he remains faithful. Did you hear that? And by means of the Cruciatus Curse, torture of the Auror Frank Longbottom and... Longbottom? <laughs> what? That's the guy right there. I always feel like it always takes me a minute to catch up. Hello, father. You are no son of mine. Look at his you tongue. see the tongue? Yeah. What? Every time I get close to an answer, it slips away. It's maddening. Yeah, I'm sure. It was in the summer, before school. In the dream, I was in a house. The dream is coming around again. Mm -hmm. And Wontel was there too, and Mr. Crouch's son. Have there been others like this? Yeah, that's him. These dreams, what I see, you don't think it's actually happening, do you? That's what I'm afraid of. I think it's unwise for you to linger over these dreams, Harry. I think it's best if you simply... Take them now. Cast them away. It's a sign, Severus. You know what it means as well as I. <laughs> That's the tattoo. That is the tattoo. It's Snake. Potter. What's your hurry? Huh, Snake, what are you up to? Mm -hmm. He always seems like he's up to something. 
Gillyweed may be innocuous, but boom slang skin, lace swing flies. You and your little friends are brewing polyjuice potion, and believe me, I'm going to find out why. Snape. I can't believe he was a Death Eater. Mm. Their instruments are cool. That fight song. It's like a three horns trombone. Earlier today, Professor Moody placed the Triwizard Cup deep within the maze. Maze. Patrol the perimeter. So at any point, a contestant wished to withdraw from the task. Now, is Diggory a Hufflepuff because of his colors, yellow and black? I don't know. That just dawned on me. Oh, find the cup if you can. But be very wary. You could just lose yourselves along the way. That's Ooh. it. Good luck. Good boy. See, you later. See you later, Dad. Oh. <laughs> Remember at the very beginning they came in with the Weasleys. <laughs> <laughs> he keeps messing that cannon up. <laughs> So I know that Diggory is competition with Harry, but he just seems so likable. Ooh, it's go time. Oh, and then all the sound goes out. That's weird. What a maze. Do you see how extensive it oh. is? My God. Yeah, that's going to take forever. It took me two years to get out of there. <laughs> oh, God, Lady, that scared me. You didn't mention the maze would eat you. The eerie feeling. Mm -hmm. Yeah, see, she's she's freaking out. Just got eerie. <laughs> Is his eyes in it? Yeah, so his like? eyes are like fucked. <gasps> oh. What is happening? What is happening? His eyes look like glaze over. That dude who had the tattoo, I bet all his guys are Death Eaters. Yeah, something's up with dude. Y'all give us some, some extra detail on what's up with him. The maze is just eating her. Periculum! Is that like a flare? What in the world? <laughs> this is a gnarly maze. So not only you got the maze collapsing on, you got a homeboy who's trying to eat you. Expelium! <laughs> He's bewitched. Is that why his eyes were like that? Yes. It's a race. Foot race. Oh. Wow. Don't let it take him. Oh, you gotta go help. You've gotta help him. Come on. Come on, Harry. Don't think about it. We're doctors. Diggory, now let him go get it, cause he saved you. I was you, about to okay? say that you better let Harry win. He saved your tail. Thanks. Go get it. You were gonna let it get me. For a moment, so did I. Some game, huh? Some game.
Yes, I'm game. This has been. Run. Go on, take it. You saved me. Take it. Yeah. That, that's right. Two, three. three. Okay. Yeah. You. <gasps> Look where they Yeah, I was just about to say that. And the tombstone riddle. Remember who that is, don't you? Well, his his name was Riddle. Yeah. It's a port key. It's a port key. Harry, the cup is a port key. I've been here before in a dream. Yep, Tom Riddle. We have to get back to the cup now. What are you talking about? Oh no. Back to the cup. Oh no. Ew. Ew. We're Ew. looking like a baby worm. Like the chocolate lady in SpongeBob. No. Cedric. He's like a parasite at this point. You, the servant, willingly sacrificed. Oh, she, she just cut off his hand. That is the enemy. No. He's about to bring some freaking Baltimore back. <laughs> He's really about to bring this. Mm. The Dark Lord shall rise. Come on. Ew, it's like an embryo. Oh. Come on, can we ever just get rid of him? I can't stand rat dude, man. Ew. Look at him like embracing it. Looking like a turtle with no shell. Oh, dude's weird. Master. Thank you. Master. The other arm worked out. Why? This is about to get so bad. The Death Eaters. Not even you. Look at the hair. Lucius. See the hair? Had more than whisper. I assure you, my lord, I never renounce the... Of course, he's, he's part of this. That is my true mask. I return. <laughs> Mm. Out of fear, not loyalty. You have proved yourself useful these past few months, Wormtail. Wormtail. Gave him back his hand. Thank you, Master. Thank you. Oh. I'm so sad about him. I'm so sad about him. How lies have fed your legend, Harry. Shall I reveal what really happened that night? Yes. Years ago? Yeah. Yeah. Ouch. How I truly lost. Yes. She provided the ultimate protection. I could not touch him. Things have changed. I can touch you. <sighs> you know how bad that probably has to hurt him? Because mm. even when he's near, it hurts. <laughs> His tongue. First, we bow to each other. Come on now, Harry, the niceties must be observed. Dumbledore wouldn't want you to forget your manners, would he? I said, bow. He's not supposed to do that. No! no. He doesn't play by the rules. He's using the forbidden spells. Especially your filthy muggle mother. Mm. 
characters. No one will ever again question my power. Yeah, I'm sure that's eating him up, the fact that people question him. And I, being a merciful lord, obliged. Get up! Homeboy, you ain't got a nose. Don't you turn your back on me, oh. Harry Potter! I want you to look at me when I kill you! I want to see the- This isn't playing fair! Come on, Harry. Come on, Harry. He's mine! What's going on? God. Keep going, Harry. What is going on? Harry, take my body back, will you? Take my body back to my- Oh, Cedric! Oh. <laughs> Sweetheart, you're ready! It was his mom. <laughs> Look at them helping him. He made it out. He got up out of there. He's gone. They don't know what's coming though. They don't know the Dark Lord's returned. <laughs> they don't realize that Diggory's dead. <laughs> they don't realize it. <laughs> Not that. It's all right, Harry. It's all right. Oh, Harry. A boy's just been killed. The body must be. He used that spell on him. Too many people. Uh, oh, his daddy! <laughs> That's my son! Stop! Oh, yeah. My boy! This is not where you want to be right now. No, no. Oh. I got you. Come on. Mm. Were so evil. <laughs> they need to get them kids up out of there. Every year they need to get them kids up out of there. <laughs> like he's officially back, got his own body. He ain't resting on the back of some dude's head no more. Mm. Like he's really back. What was he like? Who? The Dark Lord. Ah. He put the cup where he's the one who placed the cup. Was he? Yeah. I don't know. He did the whole it was like tongue a deal. Fall into one of my dreams. Something weird's happening. Into one of my nightmares. Come on, no. Please, can Harry have a break? <laughs> he went to get the drink. <laughs> what is his drink? Were there others? In the graveyard, were there others? I don't think I said anything about a graveyard, Professor. I think Neville Longbottom, the witless wonder, could have provided you a gillyweed if I hadn't given him the book that led him straight to it. Ah! So what's he saying? What's he saying? You put my name in the Goblet of Fire. You bewitched Crumb, but... but that's you, you, why? You ended up in that graveyard tonight because it was meant to be so. And now the deed is done. He wanted in there the blood so Voldemort could come back. Imagine how he will reward me when he learns I have once and for all... <laughs> Silenced the great Harry Potter. That's my Severus! Uh, 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 are you? No. Is he in this room? What? Is he in this room? How do you get away from there? What in the. You all right, Alistair? Sorry, Albus. That's moody, but then who's. Polyjuice person. Now we know who's been seeding from your store, Severus. We'll catch up in a minute. What? And what is he or who is he? <laughs> He's that guy. <laughs> the the tongue thing. The tongue, that's why we seen it earlier. You know what this means, don't you? He's back. 
Lord Voldemort has returned. I'm sick. I'm sorry, sir. I couldn't help it. How are we supposed to sleep now? I'll be welcomed back like a hero. Percy, I've never had much time for heroes. Put him away, Snake. Come on, Snake. Go get an abracadabra. See you later. That's not it. <laughs> Go to sleep forever. See you later. Abracadabra, sleep forever. A really terrible loss. Frederick Diggory was, as you all know, exceptionally hardworking. I was about to say, he was such a likable character. Mm -hmm. Cedric Diggory will not have died in vain. You remember that. No, he did. He was trying to save Harry. He was. He was such a good boy. Kind and honest and brave and true. Right to the very end. <laughs> he was. I really wish I just could have came back. I put you in terrible danger this year, Harry. Yeah, if they would just not let him compete. And Voldemort's wand and mine sort of connected. Priori incantatum. Peculiar. You saw your parents that night, didn't you? They reappeared. No spell can reawaken the dead, Harry. I trust you know that. Dark and difficult times lie ahead. Soon we must all face the choice between what is right what is easy yeah it's about to get even worse yeah it's about to be amped up now you're not alone he's definitely not alone that's for sure Bye. another year at hogwarts mm -hmm. everybody saying goodbye It's cool. How, it's cool how they combine all the schools. Like, God, I always keep it like that. I loved this one. <laughs> Do you we'll ever just have a quiet year, Uncle? Yes, right. Yes. <laughs> he said that with like, like it was okay. It was actually. I promise you'll write this summer, both of you. I won't. Mm? You know I won't. Right. <laughs> Harry will, won't you? Yeah, every week. Oh. <laughs> Lion. Those are the fancy ladies. <laughs> I love that. That is so cool. That is such a sack. Theirs is awesome. the SS trippy. Remember, he had the power turned into a shark, so I mean, they go into water, I guess, with their boat. Another absolutely I mean they get crazier and crazier as we go and especially now that Lord Voldemort's back I can only imagine what number five is gonna have in store for us but the storyline behind this one this absolutely crazy like I, I like the dude with with the ideal but I didn't know that he was being taken over by like like that part was a big shock too there's always a big shock. Well, because I was wondering, that guy appeared in the very beginning, and then we didn't see him again the rest of the movie. Yeah, we didn't see him a lot, but, like, when that guy was doing, like, the tongue thing, and, like, it, yes. was, it was cool to see how they showed how he was morphing back in to was mm. really behind it the whole so, time. But how he, like, how he had set it up the, every single step for Harry to end up in that graveyard so he could get his blood to Voldemort. Right, and you, you realize now, the uh, whatever his name was, Junior, he was playing the scientist, you realize Ouch. he killed his father. Yeah. In the woods. He was going to end up That's killing his true. father because his father sent him to uh, Azkaban. Yeah, like, but the thing is, is, like, after the other Harry Potter movies, I feel like we've been left with, like, a good taste in our mouth. Like, okay, we did it. <laughs> Get to go home for the summer, drink some snow cones, you know, relax, easy. But in this one, it's like, oh, Voldemort's back. How can you sleep? How can you rest? Uh, How can Harry ever feel safe again? Because now he's mm. got his blood in him. And how he was brought back, like, from, like, like the, like, newborn, mm. like, old fetus. Like little baby wrinkly, fetus. weird fetus thing, and how he was morphed back into him was like, I don't know. There's just so much thought that goes into it that I feel like we could sit here and talk about how you know the plot is so perfectly you know set up to work up, uh, set up to work out. But like, we could talk for days about how great this is. Oh, it was, and then like I said, Voldemort had it, and the junior guy had it 
planned out so perfect. Took over his body, made the cup, the teleport deal. So when they went to win it, That's nuts. put him right in the graveyard, right where Voldemort was at, waiting on Yeah, him. but I'm really upset about Diggory because I thought he was, like, oh. such an awesome character. Mm. I loved how he, his spirit kind of never wavered. He was kind of, like... Mm. Just good. Right. Just, like, and, really good. And it was cool. Him and Harry were kind of helping each other through yeah, through I, the tournament. And, and Digger, obviously, much older than Harry. So, for him to still kind of help Harry out was cool. Well, I just loved it because like, it was, like, a really good show mm. of, like, you know, how to be there for somebody. Even if even if you're in competition. But one thing that bothers me about the story is how Wormtail's the person who brings back Voldemort. Like, how is Wormtail? Like, no. I despise him. I think he's... So much. He, he's just so him, grimy. Luci- Lucius, whatever. Oh, uh, we didn't even forget to even talk Malfoy's about Malfoy's dad. I mean, you... You should have known. You should have known that he was a Death Eater. You should have absolutely But known. does everybody else know? Like, what are, can we get rid of him now? Oh, and a point. They brought up Snape as Brent being uh, an old they Death did. Eater. They did. Oh, my gosh. I feel so, like you're just bringing stuff in that I'm like, so oh, my gosh. I'm ready to kind of see where that story because goes. Because he, he has so many moments where he's a good guy, but you the whole time you're like, yeah, Snape, you're not tricking me. Yeah, you're yeah, bad. Yeah. Something's, still, something's still about you. Yeah. I, I, you ain't got me fooled yet, but like I said, he he's helped. He's been a good guy, so... I'm just really, really excited to get into the next one already now, especially since Voldemort's back. Like, I want to watch it. I want to watch them back to back. I know, but I'm still, like, I'm nervous. Like, I'm, I'm just, like, really, really nervous that he's back. Like, can we just leave him as a Tom little baby Riddle, fetus? Man. Yeah. Tom Riddle. That was just, it was just like a really, again, well put together movie. Of no course. doubt. But, guys, thank y'all so much, especially for getting us into the, the Harry Potter franchise. It has been so much fun. And, down four. Hey, we got number five coming up next time for you guys. They come by so fast. They really do. I don't want to so be so on fast. number five. I want to be like back at the mm. beginning. Four more to go. But as we always send you out of here, we love you. We thank you. We appreciate you. And remember, every day that you guys wake up is a blessing and that you are blessed. And for your new family members, to hit that subscribe button down below. We welcome y'all to the RSR family, but y'all got to go every day. On, same on all of our channels. Let them know. Huh? Guys, you got to make somebody smile. We love y'all. Until next time, we'll see you guys later.